We stick together like the glue on the lashes On flee like the brows, never throwing in a towel Always ready for the town, looking beautiful together You're stronger than ever, your community don't tether Yeah, your sisters forever Girls before you missed her, be part of a team Yeah, we're beauty's big sister I said, and put your girls before you missed her Be part of a team, yeah, we're beauty's big sister Check it Hi beauties, welcome back to my beauties big sister channel. I currently have on two different foundations. So I've got on two Kat Von D foundations. We've got the viral TikTok famous Good Apple Foundation Balm. And I've also got the Kat Von D Lock It Liquid Foundation. I'm sure you've heard so much about this foundation, but I wanted to do a video half and half with my face to compare these two, see if there's a difference. I have half and half on right now. If you want to see what I think of these Kat Von D foundations, then just keep on watching. I kind of just guessed my color. So let's hope the color is right. So I'm gonna go in first off with the very, very high hyped about Good Apple Skin Perfecting Foundation Balm. Now I have seen this everywhere. This is the foundation that's meant to be incredible for dry skin. I have got the shade Medium 027. Oh, that's my lucky number, 27. So it says on here that it's infused with apple extract, which I didn't realize, obviously I knew that it was called um, the Good Apple Foundation, but it's actually got apple extract in here to help nourish the skin. Uh, it says it's buildable for coverage, hydrating, lightweight long wear, a fresh matte finish. It also helps to minimize the appearance of pores and give skin a smooth, healthy look non-cakey, flashback free. I mean, it sounds like it's everything we want from a foundation. This is a fully recyclable packaging as well, which I really like. And the color looks pretty good for me. I don't know whether it's just me, it just doesn't look like there's a lot of product in here. I feel like I would go through this quite quickly. I love that on the Boots website, it actually says as seen on TikTok. Like that's how TikTok famous this is. This is 29 pounds and I'm gonna use it with the Lock It Edge foundation brush. Okay, I haven't use anything from Kat Von D in a while so I'm excited to dip back in to her products because I've always loved her products but this product I feel like it's got Kat Von D back on the map like everybody is talking about this so I'm just gonna sweep my brush into this packaging feels like it might break quite easily because I am obviously the most clumsiest person in the whole entire world so I think I'd <laughs> have to be careful with that compact lid Okay, well, let's sweep this on. Ooh, coverage. <laughs> okay, the coverage is, is good. <gasps> I mean, I know I've seen on a lot of TikToks the coverage, but I, I just, it's gliding on. <laughs> I feel like, you know when you're painting a wall and you've got the roller brush and you just sweep it down and it gives like the most perfect coverage. Like, I feel like I'm using a roller brush on my face. This brush is also brilliant. Okay, this is like super, super fuss free, like really, really quick to apply. I mean, I haven't even like buffed that in. I've just <laughs> sweeped it across, but I can't get over the coverage. That has fully, fully disguised all my blemishes there. Like I can't get over that. I think I'd probably go for a deeper shade, but we could definitely warm this up with like a little bit of bronzer but that yeah that just literally took me two seconds to apply I can't get over the coverage of that I actually I've used the tiniest amount when doing my makeup so I think this would actually last me for quite a long time I just can't get over like what <laughs> that's madness it looks like somebody has literally just airbrushed my skin I get the hype now I get it I don't even need to go in and top this up like it's it's done very therapeutic to apply I'm not gonna lie now I'm gonna go in with the lock it foundation which is a liquid foundation I've got the shade medium 53 neutral packaging is very cool this again is 29 pounds and um, this is more for oily skin so a full coverage liquid foundation that delivers extreme perfection and all day long wear with just a droplet so apparently you just need the tiniest bit drop and blend dispense a small droplet on the back of your hand pick it up with a foundation brush then dab it into the center of your face and blend outward building to the level of coverage you want this is a highly concentrated foundation so a little goes a very long way two pea-sized droplets is the most you'll need for a flawless 
full coverage. So this is the foundation that you'll see on like Kat Von D's Instagram where she fully covers tattoos. Like that's how much of a full coverage this is. So I'm literally just gonna take Droplet. Can you see that? Tiny, tiny bit. I prefer this color on me. This shade is really nice and warm. A little bit does go a really, really long way. I mean, this brush is like a dream to apply with. I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of concealer. And then we're just gonna go in with a little bit of powder, a little bit of bronzer, so I can see properly if I can see a difference between each side. I don't know whether the color is just throwing me off because I'm I'm preferring this side right now. I'm gonna spray my sponge. Going with a little bit of concealer. Now I'm gonna go in with the Kat Von D Lock It uh, Blotting Powder. This is in the shade Light. Love this packaging. This is very bougie. Look at this, the little puff. It does look a lot lighter than what I normally use. So I'm just gonna use just a little bit. And then I'm gonna go in with my Hula Caramel to warm baby up because I definitely need it. I need some colour in my face. I mean the bronzer is applying like flawlessly on top of that foundation. I feel like my lights were way too bright for this whole entire video and I've only just realised and turned them down so I hope that the lighting is a bit better now. And then let's just go in with a little bit of my MAC blush in the Black Cherry collection. I don't know if you'd know that I had two different foundations on either side of my face like can you tell I have quite combination skin I mean I don't have super oily I don't have super dry I think it's a, like a little bit of a combination so for me I feel like both of these foundations work for me the main thing for me is the application of them so I would say that using the balm is super super quick I mean that is like for speedy application so great for day to day if you want to wear full coverage in the day the the balm is going to be amazing for you I probably wear the lock it foundation of an evening I'm feeling like I am warming to this side more but I don't know whether that's because of the shade of it I feel like this shade is more my color but I love both of them I don't know let me know what you think in the comments below can you see a difference? Let me know. But I am super impressed by the coverage of both of them, but they don't feel heavy on the skin and they don't look cakey on the skin. Like it still looks fresh even though it's matte. Normally I like a really glowy base. It's not like a flat matte, if that makes sense. So it's still got a bit of dimension to it. I think it helps, you know, adding the blush and the bronzer, but I think it does look quite nice and like fresh faced, even though it is a full coverage foundation. I'm impressed. I would never have normally gone for a foundation like this. But after trying it, I am really, really enjoying it. I'm really undecided which one is my favorite, but I think I will probably reach for the Good Apple a little bit more purely for the fact that it's in a balm, super easy to apply. And I don't have anything else like this in my collection. So I think this is pretty genius, to be honest. And the fact that it said poreless, I mean, I, I can't see anything on my skin. It's looking pretty good. Let me know what you beauties think. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed already, then please, please do. And make sure you tap the bell button to make sure that you don't miss a video. We go on live stream every Monday at 6 p.m. So please come along and join us next Monday. And I will see you beauties in my next video. Bye. Yeah, we're beauties, big sister. Check it.